in this class, I am going to teach you introduction to computer networks. Here, what is a computer network? A system containing many combination computers or computer terminals, printers, audio, or visual displays are performed interconnected by telecommunication equipment or cables. Use it to transmit or receive information. So this is the network diagram. This is a switch, server. This is a bus, data bus. This is wide network. So all these are the wide network. It will be connected to the switch through cable or bus. This is personal computer, the firewall, the router, internet, other lines. This is wireless network. This is a diagram for showing the computer network. Types of network. There are many types of computer networks which are used worldwide. There are some types of computer that are used worldwide. LAN. You might have heard this term very frequently. Local area network, LAN, wide area network, WLAN, wireless local area network, ARM, personal area network, SAM, storage area network, LAN, global area network, MAN, metropolitan area network, CAN, control area network, LAN, desk area network, VPN, virtual area network. These are the different types of networks. So this is a LAN. How the systems are connected to the LAN. This is VAN. So there are a number of LANs will be connected to it's a VAN. Why do you know? It is a VAN. Personal three network. You can man. This is the how these are uh, distributed. We will uh, differentiate these three LAN, LAN, LAN. These are the more uh, frequently used with respect to the some characters. Ownership of network, LAN private. LAN private or public, LAN private or public. What is a LAN? LAN is a local area network. LAN wide area network. LAN metropolitan area network. Geographically, area covered by the LAN is small. LAN world area network is very large. LAN model. Design and maintenance. LAN busy. Number of plants will be connected uh, all the way now, so it is uh, not easy. Not easy. Communication medium. It's a quiet cell cable. Satellite links are PSTN. Quiet cell cable, PSTN. Optical fiber, cables, wireless, PSTN. Bandwidth. For the land low, high, moderate, data rate, speed. I low model. So because uh, design, it's a small uh, design and maintenance. So it's land is compared to the van, it is a small network, so it is easy to maintain. Whereas it is very big, so it is not easy. Here PSTN means public switch telephone network. Bandwidth. Accordingly, LAN is a local area network, it will be low. VAN it is a wide area network, it will be high. So, MAN metropolitan area, it is moderate. Network com classification by the component role. Local area network will be divided into peer to peer network and client server network. We will see what are they. Server based. So each system, each client will be connected to the server, the communication will be through server only. 
is a server based peer to peer network each um, system transmit the information from one system to other so in the one system to other we'll see peer to peer peer to peer network each computer is responsible for making its own resources available to the other computer on the network each computer is responsible for setting up maintaining its own security also each computer is responsible for accessing the required network resources from peer to peer relations the peer to peer network is small network containing less than 10 computers on a single lan in peer to peer each computer can function as both lan and server what are the advantages because it is a small one it is less expensive computer hardware so it is a small only 10 computers are there there for for maintaining the lan so it is easy to administer and low cost budget one what security will be less no storage of central point for file storage it is very hard to maintain the version control the client server network client server network will use certain computer access server and other access client server is simply a computer that available the, the network resources and provide services to the other computers and the request is the client is the computer in the main program that requests the services from the server local IP network is not only client server network relation to the text on this not one day is sent to the program not one day is it is very secure better performance very reliable and you have a centralized back it is more expensive more hardware intensive and software it tends to expensive to get the software to require what are the different types of servers file server print server application server message server and database server to file server these servers provide the services for storing retrieving and moving the data the user can read write and send the file to file server print server The print server is used for controlling and managing the printing on the net. It also offers the fax services to the net users. The application server. The expensive software and additional computing power can be shared by the computers in the network with the help of application server. Message server. It coordinates the interaction between the users, documents and applications. The data can be used in the form of audio, video, binary, text, or graphics. Hmm. What are the applications of computer? Why we will use the computer? Sharing the resources and computers, sharing the expensive software and database, communication from one computer to another. Exchange of data and information among users via internet network. Sharing of information over geographically by the users. What are the different components of the computer network? Two or more computers, a cable or links between the computers, network interface card in each computer, switches, OS. benefits of the network benefits sharing and 
connected to sharing the resources. So sharing the resource may be hardware sharing the software share. So that it allows the users to share many hardware devices which are printers, models, CD RAM players. The software resource to reduce the cost of the software installation. So generally we will use a um, you know, software like uh, um, design real as a design software and all we will put it in the main server and the server will be connected to the all the clients so um, you can the number of uh, uh, students can be used with the same server by downloading the particular software okay. other benefits increase its speed Reduce the cost, improve security, email, centralized software management. So, what are the disadvantages of high cost of administration? Requires time for administration. If the server is very low, cable fault. So how the different networks you will see, various LAN network, shared channel network, Ethernet. So like uh, most of the uh, office things will be available like this. This is the Hotahot network. Different network users, common resources. Routers. What is a router? Different components in the network. You will see in the next step. Different different devices, different cables to use it. So, by the wireless links to the other car with the number of meters, sensor numbers, and routing. Thank you.